Ajax and England both practised under the roof today, and it is a roof that has all players excited for a dry and fast-paced test match tomorrow night. After the Christchurch Stadium plans were revealed, All Blacks captain Richie McCaw says he's all for the proposal and gotten used to the roof in Dunedin. Oh, it's huge. It'll be great, you know, like uh, we're running around on Tuesday in the cold and wet, uh, knowing you can play in the dry ball and an atmosphere like this. Um, you know, it's superb, and anyone that that wants to see how good it is, have a, watch a game here or, you know, run around out it here, it's uh, superb. So if we could have something like this in Christchurch, it should be brilliant. The stadium offers a dry ball and should help free the game up for both sides to score plenty of points. But after a narrow win last week, McCaw says the team is more focused and ready to take the field. Well, they, they've definitely been a bit of edge to them. You know, and a meeting on Monday morning uh, ensures that, really, um, and rightly so. Um, but I think just a week together, you know, you don't have to as much stuff. It's about uh, polishing it a bit, and um, because of that, we've been able to add a bit of intensity. The opposition has made several changes to the back line that narrowly lost in Auckland. But McCaw says those changes don't make England any less dangerous. Oh, look, look, we've had a good week, but you know, uh, you can't just uh, think that's just going to mean a performance tomorrow. Um, it's good to get to this point. Uh, guys pretty clear and, and, and excited about tomorrow. Now we've got to make sure we, we transfer that to the field. If the All Blacks can win in front of a sold-out crowd, they will claim yet another series victory over their northern rivals. And when asked whose mum brings the best half-time oranges, McCaw mentioned one local lad. I actually don't know that, but uh, one uh, Malachi's uh, parents, first time out of Tonga last week, they couldn't believe how many buildings there were in Auckland uh, to come to New Zealand, so uh, maybe may put her in charge. And fans hope it will be those oranges that give the home side the spark they need to steal yet another victory over the English. John McKenzie, 39, Deneen News. Still to come on 39 Dunedin News.